This is not for the faint of heart. At 18 feet tall, on slick, packed snow, where snowboarders can reach speeds of 28 miles per hour and heights of 15 feet, this superpipe is no joke. The superpipes are a signature item, and we take a lot of pride in that. We're at Okemo Mountain Resort in Vermont. It has one of about half a dozen superpipes on the East Coast. The ski business has remained flat. So resorts hope that by putting big money into super pipes and terrain parks, they will attract customers looking to take their experience to new heights. Why do you think so few mountains on the East Coast invest in a super pipe? It's expensive. Uh, as you can see, it takes a lot of time. Step one, make snow. How many tons of snow or gallons of water is needed to make this super pipe? Uh, this one will be about 9 million gallons. Uh, we will spend probably around $60,000 to $70,000 to complete the entire uh, pipe. Step two, make two walls of snow 18 feet tall. Yep. All right. The vertical part of the pipe, and that's what the most critical part of a pipe is because if it's too laid back, it'll send riders out of the pipe. And if it's too inverted, it'll send them in it. That's a lot of pressure on you to oh, get it right. Yeah, yeah. I feel like I'm on a roller coaster. Step three, precision cutting. This is a Zog machine, and it uses lasers to sculpt the super pipe. When the Zog is turned on, it's really a giant snowblower. That's probably the coolest thing. Ta-da! It's now a super pipe. Total cost, half a million dollars. But only 5 to 10% of people who come to Okemo use the super pipe each year. Is it too niche of a market? With the super pipe here, uh, it's one of the few sports that is uh, part of the Olympics. Hannah Teeter on the U.S. Olympic team spent a lot of time in here. We are one of the few resorts that will hold competitions for the state. So it's worth the investment? Well, this is worth the investment. We need to do everything we can do to get people to want to continue to ski and ride. Having a super pipe is one aspect of that.